Imagine swimming in the vast open ocean. The water is calm. Everything seems safe, till a massive shadow appears beneath you. A shark over 65 feet long, with jaws powerful enough to crush a car, is heading straight for you. There's no doubt about it. This is Megalodon, the most terrifying apex predator to ever rule the oceans. But just how powerful was it? Did anything dare challenge it? Why did it vanish from the seas? Stick around until the end of the video because the truth might shock you. Megalodon lived approximately 23 to 3.6 million years ago, during the Neogene period. It was in T just the biggest shark, but also one of the most powerful predators in Earth's history. So how massive was it? Fully grown Megalodon could reach lengths of 50 to 65 feet, with some estimates suggesting up to 80 feet. To put that into perspective, it was three times the size of today's largest great white sharks. Its jaws alone measured about 10 feet wide, meaning it could easily swallow an adult human whole. But size wasn't the scariest part. Megalodon had the strongest bite force in history. Estimated at 40,000 pounds per square inch, stronger than crocodiles, T-Rex, and even modern great whites. It could crush the bones of any prey including giant whales. But how did it hunt? Megalodon wasn't just massive. It was also an intelligent and agile predator. It could swim at speeds of up to 25 miles per hour, allowing it to launch devastating ambush attacks. Instead of biting randomly, Megalodon had a lethal hunting strategy. It targeted the ribs, its fins, or tails of its prey, crippling them before going in for the kill. Fossil evidence shows deep bite marks on prehistoric whale bones, proving that Megalodon could crush through bone to access the most nutrient-trich parts. But did anything in the ocean dare challenge Megalodon? Even though Megalodon was an apex predator, it wasn't completely invincible. Some potential rivals included Liviatin, a massive predatory whale with 14-inch long teeth, capable of fighting back against Megalodon. Bazosaurus, a giant marine reptile that lived before Megalodon, but could have been a formidable opponent if they coexisted, giant whales. Some prehistoric whales were large and strong enough to defend themselves against Megalodon attacks. However, there is no solid evidence that any of these creatures could consistently defeat a Megalodon in a one-on-one -on -one fight. So if it was such a dominant predator, why did Megalodon go extinct? Megalodon went extinct around 3.6 million years ago. Scientists have proposed several possible reasons for its disappearance. Climate change. As the Earth entered an ice age, ocean temperatures dropped, reducing Megalodon's hunting grounds. The rise of modern whales. Many whales evolved to be larger, faster, and more intelligent, making them harder prey for Megalodon. Competition with great white sharks. The ancestors of today's great white sharks may have competed with Megalodon for food, further pressuring its survival. But could Megalodon still exist somewhere in the depths of the ocean? Despite many myths, scientists confirm that Megalodon is extinct. However, the ocean remains largely unexplored. Could there still be undiscovered giants lurking in the deep? Do you think could Megalodon still be out there, or is there another predator even stronger than it? Let us know in the comments, and don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more amazing content on prehistoric predators.